Okay guys, hello and welcome back to the tutorials. Tutorial. In this tutorial, we are going to finish the plane. We are going to put uh, up the vertical stabilizer, we're going to put up the horizontal stabilizer, touch up the livery, fix up the back of the wing, um, and finish off all of this. It will be unique, to say the least. <clears throat> now, what we're going to do, we're going to go from the your back window, we're going to, oh, actually, first of all, we need this. And uh, no, yeah, okay, so from your back window, you're going to go, I'm going to put a block of snow there, and you're going to go two, and head, one, two. Then you are going to take it all the way back until you get to here. Then you're going to replace these blocks. Okay. Now, what we're going to do is we are going to go up in threes, I think. Um, I'm just checking. Uh, no, we're going to go up in fours. So you're going to go one, two, three, four, five fours, and then you're going to come out one. You're going to go one, two, three, four, five, six. I'm gonna come down one, two, and then it's gonna be diagonals. Like so. If we just put this down, you're gonna put two right there. No, three. So, like that. Does that look extremely big? Yeah, yeah, it does. So, what we're going to do is we are going to cut this here one, two, three, four, five, six, and then you're just going to take off this and everything above. Pretty basic, nothing too complicated. There. No, still doesn't look good. So we're gonna bring all this back about three blocks. So one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, and then I'm gonna just bring it up. Like that again. And then you're just going to take all this off. Does that look good? I think I think that suits. Now we're gonna fill up three layers. One, two, and three should be the bottom. So one, two, three. Now, you're going to come over here, I'm going to count one, two, three, four, and then one, two, three, 
actually, let me just get this right. Okay, and then there and there. Okay, cool. Now, so on the fourth layer is going to go one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten of scion, and then one snow. Now you can go ahead and fill up this layer, and then here we're going to put a K. So K, and then here we're going to put L, and here we are going to put M. Just like that. Nothing too complicated. And fill that in. Boom. And then we're going to build just a little crown. No, we're going to build four dots because I think that's what it is. If I am right. Here we go. One, two, three, four. Now there should be a crown here, but I am easily messing this up. If you think you can, go to your reference picture and work off that. But this is this for now. No, not the worst thing in the world, but it could be improved. Uh, yeah. Okay, cool. So we're going to go back to our stone slab. We are going to come to this block over here. Go one, two, three, four, five, six, and then we are going to take that out four. So one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. And then this goes up. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Now, this is going to come in like this. One, two, three. You're going to go two, and then you're going to go into. So, like that. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> that uh, seems to work. Um, you know, we're going to go back here and we're going to take this out another four. I'm going to bring it up. One, two, three, and four. Okay. This one comes over here, and we're going to put one over there. Okay, now what we're going to do is we're going to line this up here like that. So we're going to take that and we're going to go one, two, three, four right here. Here we are going to take this and go one, two, three, four over here for that. And then for this bit, we're just going to fill it in. Real simple. So, I 
and then on this one we are going to do the same so there are six blocks so we're going to put these two in and the same up here I'm going to fill that up and we're just going to pop that over two blocks and you fill this in as well really simple And one more time, we fill this in. <clears throat> no. Now. Now, this actually, I'm not happy with this. As I told you, like, this is how I build. You, you build something, and then you look at it, and you go, no, I don't like that. So, we're going to delete this layer over here. Okay. We're going to add a block here. We're going to count four. And then, we are going to go one more. And then like that. And then one. And then one. And then one. I see just like that, it looks a bit better. So just always remember to go back over it. And if you don't like it, change it. It's that simple. Okay, now for the interior, which you'll be relieved. I actually know what I'm doing. I don't know for this it's I should call it more of a let's build than a tutorial because it's not a block by block thing if I do another tutorial on a plane it will be more of a put five blocks here and then four blocks there and then two blocks here I don't know for this I just kind of I don't know I'm trying to show you how I build so you get some gray it could be grey wool or grey terracotta, grey anything. Now we're going to fill these two layers here like this in. Hella simple. <coughs> Sorry. Just like that. And we're going to go back. And then... We're going to take the quartz stairs and fill it in like this. And then I'm going to show you guys a trick that will work on most versions of Minecraft. It might even work on this one. <clears throat> now the thing is with the new 737s, they have... I guess what you call ambient lighting and that's what we're going to do so if you look on a 737 photo it kind of goes in and around there's lights way over in the back over there so what we're going to do we are going to get ourselves here some glowstone if I can ever find it where did the glowstone go is that the glowstone is that the glowstone there you go okay then we are going to get us a quartz slab. Now what we're going to do is we're going to fill in the glowstone this layer over here. <clears throat> okay, and then we are going to fill this like that. So 
the interiors are really simple. Interiors of these planes. So from up here it looks a bit weird, but so from there it kind of looks weird, but from down here you do get a bit of lighting. It does work better when you have two sets of uh, thingamabobbers um, doing the thing, doing uh, the thing. So grey terracotta, quartz, da da da. We just zoom up here. Uh, we take the lever from here. We put it in the middle of these doors. And we put it on this door. Then we start with the bathroom so you get a wooden door any time any kind prefer preferably one that doesn't like have too much window then what you're going to do is you're going to get a get any type of stair whichever suits stair a button a pillar quartz block And I think they're called item frames. Yeah, item frame. So we are going to put the item frame there, the button there, quartz block there. There's your toilet paper. Then you have your toilet and your button. Really simple. Now, what we're going to do, we're going to put a button here. And we're going to put this iron door right here. Because that is a captain's cabin. Don't want to mess with the captain's cabin. Now for here, we are going to put two stone slabs, two cobblestone stairs. And we're going to put some stone brick stairs there like that. And we are going to put a stone brick stair here like that, a slab there. We're going to cut down here, and we're going to put a stone stair there. I usually use achacha for this, or acacia, whatever you want to call it. And put that there. Some redstone, redstone repeater as well. And there you go, you have your throttle. <clears throat> and then you get your sign, and you can do whatever you want with them. You could do something like that, and then. that and that that and then just that again just some basic kind of thing. I don't really know what to call it. Some black carpet. Just put that all across there. And that's your cockpit. It's not too complicated. It's not too simple either. Uh, a bit of glowstone for the lighting. 
There you go, there's your cockpit. Um, now we get ourselves uh, snow. And just cover these in. And then we get ourselves stone walls. And you put them every second block. Okay, and we're going to do this right after you cross there. We're going to do that three times. Then we're going to fill it up with snow again. It's going to be the cargo bay area. And then we're going to go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. On the eighteenth block, you're going to fill this up with snow. And then we are going to get ourselves some quartz slabs and some quartz stairs. And then we're going to fill this like that. Quartz stairs. And then again, quartz stairs. And then we're going to put some quartz slabs. No, not quartz slabs. We're going to get some rails and snow no not snow uh, white carpet I will do now your rails you just take and you fill in all the way up to here white carpet you fill in up to here and there you go that's your cargo bay area now Gonna take sponge. Just because I don't know what else to wall the this is supposed to be the fuel. I don't know what the inside of a fuel tank looks like. So I chose sponge. You're going to do that up until you reach the gear. Then you're going to put snow there. And sponge there. And then you're going to take this over here. Fill that with sponge. That's your little fuel area. Here, you can build a little redstone thing for a lamp. I'm just going to leave that clear for now. We're going to have another... Uh, yeah, another cargo bay area, I feel. This isn't the most detailed of planes, so I'm not, I'm just kind of randomly deciding where the stuff goes. But if it was detailed, you'd get what, like you'd know what you'd be getting. You'd do the research. And eventually, guys, you will get used to the kind of feel of building these kind of things. So just get used to it. There's really nothing more I can say. You will get used to building. And then we're just going to go back to the stair, to the walls. Every second block. And if you're wondering what this is for, it's kind of like a, a skeleton. For the plane. Now I'm not sure if anybody else has done this, and if they have, then I'm sorry. But for me, this is what I do. There you go. And that's what your plane should look like if you're building with World Edit. Not that hard. Pretty simple plane. Um, now I'm gonna switch over to World Edit and copy and paste this and flip it and do all that, and then I'll be right back with you guys. Okay, guys, and with World Edit, I have done this thing. Now, um, if you guys want to know how I did that with World Edit, um, 
so if you have world edit, so let's say we just build a random selection of blocks here, okay? Let's just line them up so that you can tell which ones are which. Okay, let's say you want to flip it. You select position one, select position two. Uh, let's copy it from here. Slash slash copy. It copies it. And then if you go, if you, depending on the way it, you look, it will flip to behind you. So if I look here, it'll flip like that. And if I look there, it'll flip like that, you know? So let's just go slash flip paste it copies it exactly as it is so it's really it's the exact same thing with um, building planes you just copy paste literally that simple okay and this is your end result you know, it's really not the best thing I've ever built, but it's it's not the worst thing I've ever seen. So you want that one closed because this door is always open because the jetway comes in here. You got your cockpit, your your cockpit. Everything's copied, and now this shouldn't actually be there, but there you go. Uh, ooh, I should probably. Probably build a Bhutan. Yes. And then this is what you get when I told remember when I told you about ambience. Ambiance. If I just set the smooth lighting. Yeah, okay, smooth lighting, but that's what you should be getting. It's all bright up here, but it's kind of a smooth up there. If you have shaders it'll look better. <laughs> that's what I got now if you want you can put some crafting tables some chairs fashion seatbelt signs it's really not the hardest thing in the world um, but yeah so that was the tutorial if you guys want another tutorial and I promise you if I do another tutorial it won't be like this I'll, have, I'll, I'll plan it out and I'll be, do it block by block, and I'll be like, build four this way, and then five this way, and then count 55. No, because with this, I was kind of just like, oh, I need to do something. So I did something, and I decided that that something was a tutorial. But yeah. Pretty simple, I think. Uh, so this is the kind of concept of how I build planes, and it's really kind of hectic, and probably not the most efficient, but it's my way of doing it. And it seems to work. If you guys have a different way of doing it, please comment and tell me. But um, either way, I'd love it if you guys uh, liked and commented and subscribed and did all that good stuff because it helps and it helps motivate me to keep doing YouTube. Because if I don't get any subs, I'm just kind of like, eh, shouldn't do it. It's weird because most of my videos right now barely get over seven views. And then I have one video that has over 1k views, which I'm actually so happy about. It's um, it's really a big thing for me, guys. Um, thanks for seeing that video 1,000 times. I don't know what's so special about that one, but thanks. It really means a lot to me. Um, so yeah, the Minopia thing is still open. Uh, I'm looking for people to help me with it. Uh. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. If you have any suggestions of videos that I should do, tell me. I've got a bunch of games. I've got Mad Max, Player Unknowns, Battlegrounds. I've got the Stick Man, Stick Fight. Like basically, just request it, and I'll try get it for you. I even do like game reviews or first impressions or whatever. So. Yeah. If you guys like it, then tell me. I'm going to stop being awkward. <laughs> and, uh, yeah. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next video.
Bye.